guys, welcome to my Lebanon vlog and Merry Christmas to you all. So today is Christmas Eve and we're gonna be celebrating it with my fiance's relatives where we are heading in a few minutes. But I just want to welcome you to the vlog and I'm so excited and I'm so glad to be back. The last time I was here, it was three years ago and I only stayed for five days. But I did a vlog which I'm gonna link below and that video was a really good hit because I think that is the video that has the most views in my channel and yeah thank you for all the ones who watched that video especially to my Lebanese viewers hello there and yeah I'm so glad to be here and I'm gonna try to bring you along this vacation this time I'm gonna be staying for two weeks so there's a lot more time for me to roam around and see a lot more places that Lebanon has to offer all right, so we're gonna head over to Charbel's relatives now to spend Christmas. Mm -hmm. So Merry Christmas once again, and I'll see you later. Bye. Merry Christmas. <laughs> because I didn't get to vlog really um, during the Christmas dinner um, but anyway a good morning to everyone Merry Christmas and today we are at Zaytuna Bay it's nice and cold here and we are surprising at PF Shag's our favorite place to eat even in Qatar but Charbel insisted that he wants to try PF Chang's in Lebanon so we're gonna have our food here and I know there's plenty of time to try out Lebanese food but for now we're gonna be stuck with PF Chang's so look at the traffic of people in Zaytuna Bay everyone is just outside because it's the holidays So dessert just came in. This is the crepe pouch. So I think this is crepe with ice cream inside. Oh, okay. There it is. Yummy. And Charbel got an avocado drink. Oh my gosh, that's so big. Um, downtown Beirut to do a little bit of strolling. There's so many shops here and so many people. <laughs> wow. Oh, look at the lights. So pretty. guys good afternoon and it's a beautiful day today and we are about to leave home to go have some lunch and then I'm gonna have my hair done today so I'm gonna have my hair colored probably get some low lights and highlights darken it a little bit remove the orange um, shade from my hair I don't see it uh, too much light. Is it not? Yeah. It's not color with your skin uh, color. Thank you, baby. We're here in the village and it's very loud because it's a packed restaurant, but the village has so many restaurants and it's such a chill and cute place. Today we're at DB. I saw it in Tomato and it has really good reviews, so we're so excited to try it. Okay, so our food just came in. I ordered the yeah, Sharba cannot wait, so Sahten baby. <laughs> so 
we ordered Mumbai chicken and then this is Oishi and crab salad. I hear a lot of good things about the salad in Zomato. So we're so excited to try that. And volcanic shrimps, which just looks the same as the one at P.F. Chang. How about you try it, baby, and you tell me how is it? It's not comparing to... P.F. Chang's. He, he is the connoisseur for P.F. Chang's, by the way. The master of P.F. Chang's. How about the salad? They say it's really good, so I hope it's really good. Mm. Ah, it's good? Let's try this. It's just like candy salad. Okay, I'm gonna try the Mumbai chicken. Looks so good. Much better. Why? Mmm. I like it, baby. It's really grilled nicely and it has a full flavor to the chicken. It's not bland at all. Back home and I figured I haven't really shown you my hair in better lighting. So this is how my hair looks like after the salon appointment. It's a bit lighter. I said I'm gonna go darker but turns out after I showed the picture, it's actually lighter color than my original one, but at least it's not orange anymore. So yeah, that's the hair and I love it. Hi guys, good afternoon and we're braving the cold weather this morning or I mean this afternoon because it's raining really hard and also it is really really cold hence the scarf. I also brought some gloves with me because it's too cold for your Asian girl here. So anyway, um, today I think we're just gonna go to the mall because it's raining so we won't be able to really do some outdoorsy stuff as if we do outdoorsy stuff, but we won't be able to sit in a restaurant and stuff outdoors. So yeah, that's that for this morning. Uh, or yeah. yeah, finally in the parking of the mall. It took us like one hour, 30 minutes. The traffic is so bad. We left home at four and now it's 5.30. It's crazy. Anyway, we're now here in Verdun. ABC Mall, or they, it's ABC, but they say ABC here in French, you know. So yeah, we're here. Okay, so this is the mall. It's open, so we had to go back to the parking to get our... I took my gloves and scarf and all. It's cold, baby, right? Yeah. <laughs> but it's so nice. It's so fancy. And I hear I this is a... Back to <laughs> I hear back this to is a new Abyssin Mall. We're looking for a restaurant and we've decided to go to DB, which is the same restaurant we get we went to last night. So we're gonna try we're gonna eat there again because I know the food is good and even though I'd like to try another restaurant, right now I'm so hungry and I want a sure shot restaurant that's really good. So it seems DV is very famous because they're they have actually a lot of outlets here, baby. Like they have a lot of branches, not only the one in the village. But a lentil soup for the starter, and I have already tried it. It's really really good. It's so tasty and it's so thick. Like see, so flavorful, right, baby? And as Charbel said, this is Lebanese style. And Charbel said, don't touch my food. <laughs> also for free, they give out this like crunchy crackers and this really good sauce. This is labne. So, so good. They add some dill on it. So it makes it more tasty. Okay, the other starter is this buffalo chicken tacos. Mm. 
Okay, so the rest of the food came in. I ordered my very own lentil soup because it was so good that I want my very own steak and fries, um, the Oishian crab noodle salad, which Charbel really likes. And it comes with a salad for my steak. And then I've shown you that we're almost done with this starter. And Charbel got your very basic um, grilled chicken with mashed potato. So yeah, I think I'm not gonna review the food anymore because I'm telling you now it's really good and I want to concentrate on eating. So yeah, that's the food for you and DV, way to go. This is caramelized thing for two. There's another part of the mall and these two are my bodyguards. <laughs> Did you close the whole restaurant? Afternoon, guys. So me and Charvel are at a restaurant now, which is called Sood, and just look at the vibe of this place. Isn't it, isn't it so cute? There's a lot of plants and this twinkling lights and it's just such a pretty place it's more of like Italian food and fusion of Spanish food as well so we're getting some pasta some pizza salad and I think Charbel is getting some grilled chicken so yeah we're so excited to try it we've got many recommendations about this place so so excited to try it out <laughs> no, we're not. Uh, we're gonna take a telefleek or like cable car going at the top of the mountain so that we can see a full view of Lebanon. And I'm so excited to take the cable car. And I saw it. It's like so one. tiny. Oh my gosh. That's so tiny. Here's the sample. <laughs> Look, I this is. <laughs> People are also stuck up and that is high up so we're not the only ones okay finally going down Ugh, I feel so dizzy now okay guys we're heading home and I just want to show you where we were a while back we were just there and it's finally nice and toasty and Charbel is taking a nap. And so I'm offering this simple phrase. 
Two kids from one to ninety-two Although it's been said many times Many ways Merry Christmas to you got into wooden bakery and they don't have the wooden ba it's like um, what's this manaki man, man ushi <laughs> man ushi with nutella and banana and they put nuts in it so yeah that's what i'm looking forward to so we're gonna try another place because it's actually like 1 13 a.m right now yeah um so we're gonna try another place I finally found the choco banana. Mm. It's okay. Road trip! So, thank you, baby! <laughs> okay, everyone knows now that it's my first time to see snow. I'm so happy! Anyway, we're waiting for the guy who will teach me how to ski. We've rented out ski equipment and all, so we're just waiting for him. And I'm gonna go ahead and change now, and then we're gonna try skiing. Or I'm gonna try try while Sharbo will be like sitting with a hot cup of coffee, maybe. <laughs> back in the car and we're about to leave Veraya. Um, so yeah, I just finished skiing so I learned how to ski. We did like 
three rounds, like an hour, 30 minutes of like skiing and stuff. So I pretty much learned the basics, but for sure I need a lot more time to practice and all. Anyway, we're leaving now to maybe take a nap before New Year's Eve. It's so much fun to do something for the first time in a long time. So yeah, and Charbo hasn't been to Faraya since I think he said the last time was maybe 10 years ago. So. Yay! So we've seen a corn vendor on the side of the road and I wanted to try this. So usually in Philippines we have it like with butter and salt but here they put it with salt and I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's curry powder or zatar powder, something like something that. Something like called kamu. Kamu, they call it kamu. Kama. Kama. But it's really good. From snowy mountain to sunny streets, on the way back to Beirut. Hey guys, back in Beirut, and me and Sharbel have already gotten ready, and we are gonna have um, a late lunch slash early dinner. Charbel are gonna go partying. I can't believe we're going out at this time. So yeah, it's been a while since me and Charbel partied. It's been I think the uh, at least two years. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm telling you now <laughs> the truth. Yeah. So we haven't partied in a while. Two years, baby. It's I a... think. Yeah. No, no. Okay. No. When was the last time? We went. Uh, we went here once. You and me. Also. Where? Not here, uh, we, I, I know we went out. The last time was with Silvio. That's it. Which was no, your years. sister also. I that don't was know. New Year two years ago, baby. <laughs> anyway, okay. It's I been want a to while. Go. She refused. Wow. <laughs> don't put it on me. Yeah, right. Okay, so yeah. I anyway. So <laughs> it's been a while. So now we're gonna meet up some friends and uh, friends. <laughs> cannot talk. And then we're gonna go to a club. So I'm so excited because I haven't actually seen uh, the Beirut nightlife here, so... day of the year and tomorrow is the day where we are gonna do our prenup photo shoot and we've already got the dress or I've already got the dress that I'm gonna wear tomorrow by Charbel's talented friend Halim Kaskov. Kaskov? Kaskov. Yeah, I'm gonna put the details down below but yeah the dress is there so I'm gonna reveal that tomorrow. I'm so excited afternoon and yes I am all ooh, dolled up because me and Charbel actually just finished the first part of our prenup shoot we are at Marmy Kyle we did like a street style um, photo shoot with Elena such an amazing photographer I'm gonna make sure to link her details down below I found her in Instagram and she did very well I saw a few of the photos that she took today and it was just so beautiful and I'm so happy.
home to change into our second look and then we're gonna head to Zarur. on the spot. <laughs> okay. Yay! Got it! Ooh, thank you baby for being such a sport. Yeah. <laughs> we had a lot of fun. Yeah, so much fun. Thanks, Elena. You're welcome. <laughs> So I haven't vlogged in a while. Uh, the past few days we've just been spending time with friends and family so I didn't vlog that much. I think the last time I spoke to you was when we did our prenup shoot. But anyway, I, I'm just updating because um, today is our flight back to Qatar in a few hours. Um, we're visiting a friend before our flight and I just wanted to show you the view of Beirut. It's a beautiful sunny day today. And yeah, I'm so sad to be leaving Beirut, but I'm so happy to have spent the last two weeks here. It was so much fun. And yeah, I just wanted to end the vlog here since you have this beautiful view and the beautiful sunlight. Uh, so yeah, thank you so much for watching this vlog. And if you made it till the end, please don't forget to like. And if you're not yet subscribed, please do so. And thank you for watching and for your respect. I cannot speak fast <laughs> and for spending your time with me and yeah have an awesome and beautiful day